Welcome, in this video I'll show you how to fix your Xbox app if it's not working or opening on your Windows 10 or 11 PC. If you find this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such tutorials. Now first up, go ahead and go to your search bar and type down Microsoft Store. Okay, click on it to open it up and then just go ahead and find Xbox like so and just hit on enter. Wait for it to load and once it loads, click on Xbox. And if there's an update button right here, just click on it, wait for the update process to finish. And once that's done, you should be good to go. Now, if that still will work, go ahead over to your search bar and type down Xbox right here. Right click on the Xbox app, now click on app settings. And in here, okay, so what you'll do is just go ahead and scroll all the way down and just click on terminate. And once done, click on reset, reset. Wait for the process to finish. And after that, restart your computer and check if it helps. Now, if that's your work, don't worry. We have a ton of options in here. You go to your search bar and type down services. Okay, click on services right here. Once it's opened, go ahead and scroll all the way down and find Xbox related applications right here or services. One, two, three, four. Okay, so what you'll do is just go ahead and uh, double click on one. And then the sort of type should be automatic. Okay. Click on automatic, hit on apply, hit on OK. Once done, move to the next service or Xbox service. Automatic, hit on apply, hit on OK. Do the same right here. OK. Automatic, apply, hit on OK. Automatic, apply and OK. And after that, restart computer, edit your work now. OK. If that still will work, go ahead and open up your PowerShell. Now, right click on your uh, start menu, click on terminal admin. Now this one will open, go ahead and go to the uh, description box and I have code one and code two. So copy code one and paste that in here and just hit on enter. Okay. And after that, copy the second code, paste that in here, hit on enter. Okay. And once that's done, just hit on exit, hit on enter, again, restart your computer and you're good to go. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.